Hello, Michael Diamond. You're watching Muscle Central. Okay, before I get started with this video, I want you to subscribe and turn on your notifications. Okay, I'm going to ask the question, what if, uh, what if Ronnie Coleman, uh, trained like, uh, Doreen Yates trained and Doreen Yates trained like Ronnie Coleman. Now, uh, First of all, they both trained heavy. Ronnie moved uh, more actual weight than Dorian did, but it doesn't mean that Dorian didn't train as heavy as Ronnie. Heavy is a relative term. Your heavy and my heavy are uh, two different things. They both trained heavy, but beyond that, uh, much, much different. Uh... Ronnie, six days a week, each body part twice a week, an hour or more in the gym, and at a high volume of work. On the other hand, Dorian probably spent no more than 45 minutes in the gym and a low volume of work. Uh, one to two warm up sets, and then one set just uh, balls to the wall, all out. Both got great results. Both dominated uh, bodybuilding during their period. But uh, would each of them have gotten the same results on stage or? Same results at the gym as far as physique wise as they had if they were trained like the other train. Uh, Dorian, uh, I would say no. Uh, plain and simple, uh, Working at, uh, at, at a rate like Ronnie was working at, there would be no way that for his body to recover properly and he would not have gotten the same type of results. That's not a knock on Torian because uh, there were very few that would be able to train, if that were they, to train uh, like Ronnie did, uh, the heavy workload and the volume to go along with it. Now, interestingly, there was some test run on him a while back. Uh, I think it was in the mid 2000s, and they discovered that. He naturally recovers at a faster rate than the average person. Now, we all know that use of enhancement drugs accelerates recovery. That's why enhanced athletes can train where they train. Because your bodies can handle it and they can recover at an accelerated rate. But they're using something. Ronnie, uh, so they say, uh, was able to uh, recover at that enhanced rate. He competed a lot of his career Natural. He went to a number of Olympias. Natural. Albeit he wasn't placing very high, but just to get on that stage against the quality athletes he was going up against were all enhanced. And him being natural says a lot. Uh, plain and simple. It everything comes down to genetics. 
Ronnie Coleman had the genetics to do that. Uh, what I'm getting at is what you, and I've, I spoke about it in a recent uh, video, find out what works, what approach works best for you and don't necessarily try to emulate what you see your favorite bodybuilder doing because it's probably gonna not going to work for you the way exactly the way it works for them uh, simply because uh, of their genetics as opposed to your genetics. Uh, I just ran off and babbled a lot over there, but I think I brought up some interesting things. And if you enjoyed the video, please like it. Please share and by all means subscribe. Do not forget to hit that notification bell. This way, every time I put up a new video, I think you'll be notified. Also, if you go to the description box, you're going to find some links there. One link is to the Facebook Muscle Central page. Any questions, you can go there and DM me. I'd be happy to answer them. Also, you find a link to Species Nutrition and Mr. Potts Protein. Click on both links, go to both websites, check out all the great products. Once again, this is Michael Diamond, and I thank you for watching Muscle Central.